Hey everybody, so I just want to start off and say thank you again. I've had some people come up to me and say, hey, you know what, Vince, I'm really sorry that you lost, but you did a good job. Now, you know what my response to that is? Hey, you know what? This isn't a failure, this is actually a triumph. This is a really good thing. I ran a campaign personally on under $500. All my own funding, didn't take any money from anyone. So for anyone to say that I didn't do something good, I feel like I did. I worked my tail off. I was the one that went and met people, went to the doors, put everything out. It was a lot of work, but you know what? That's what I believe the process is about. I don't believe it's about donors donating. I don't believe it's about getting volunteers to do things for you. I believe ultimately you gotta pull your bootstraps up and you gotta do it yourself. And I think that ideology is something that's gonna grow as the years go on because I think people want that personal connection. We're so disconnected in this world right now with tech developments and everything that people want that human touch again. And I'm here to provide that. But you know what I'm gonna say? I'm just proud of what we created. It was your ideas and some of my input and we created something really unique and good that's gonna transcend many years as we go moving forward. Special thanks to everyone here. Obviously there's a lot of people that helped, but you know what, I wanna give these individuals a really special shout out because the conversations we had, the discourse back and forth, the support, really meant the world to me and I couldn't have done it without you so thank you so much for that. I will say this though, you're not going to see me disappear. Just because I lost an election doesn't mean I'm going to go away. I'm going to stay true to Whittier because I've been in Whittier my whole life and I'm going to continue to stay in Whittier for the rest of my life as well. This is a good thing. Lots of good things are going to come. This year hopefully we're going to put together a cycling race in Whittier and it is going to be amazing and I can't wait for you to be a part of it. I will say this moving forward though. We have to fix the voter turnout. It was less than 16% this year, and that is absolutely atrocious and unacceptable to me on all standards. So moving forward, we have to make sure that all elections exceed 50%. Because how can you say you're representative if you only have less than a quarter of your populace voting? Woodyarites need to feel like they can vote and they want to vote. So we got to create that atmosphere where they want to do that. Because ultimately, I believe that governments should be afraid of their people people should not be afraid of their governments. And the only way for that creed to hold true is for people to come out and exercise and tell the government what you want it to do. If you don't go out and vote, you don't have that opportunity. That's why it's such a vital civic duty that we have to do. But we're gonna fix those things and we're gonna keep moving forward. Again, this was a fantastic election. I had a great time doing it. Learned a lot in the process. And it's one of those things moving forward we're gonna keep perfecting each and every year because we never truly hit a stance when everything is good we're always developing and that's why I'm here so again thank you from the bottom of my heart it means the absolute world to me on March 21st 2009 I was stabbed in the neck and I should have died my carotid artery and my jugular were severed most people don't live past a few minutes I managed to live somehow so for me to be able to sit here and say that I actually was involved in this election and a part of the process for Woodyard to become better there is nothing better in life than someone saying that so thank you again. I look forward to seeing you and working with you throughout the years. And God bless always and have a great rest of your night.